leafcutter ants cleaning the refuse out of their nest. Every single one of these tiny creatures knows where it's going and what it's got to do when it gets there. And furthermore, there are about 10 million more of them in this huge underground nest beneath me. They're all members of one highly organised society, but they're not the blindly mechanical robotic slaves that we once thought they were. Indeed, we now know that every insect society is full of conflict, power struggles and mutinies. Social insects construct the tallest of all non-human buildings. Like these huge termite hills here in Australia. They protect their colonies with great ferocity. They increase the size of their societies at an alarming rate. And they're capable of mobilizing huge armies to make wars on their neighbors. But how did these great communities develop? 